What it is everybody, welcome back to another video. We have been steady doing lock reviews the past few months, so I decided to try something a little more art focused and a little more different. Different like how? Different like what, you might be asking? Well, I decided I am an artist and now robots are artists. So I decided let's let the robots take over and try and make some art for us today. Yes, that's right. Today we are going to look at AI generated art with the topic of locks, of course. So if you're interested in seeing what data the AI has on locks, stay tuned because we're about to get into it. So the app we'll be using today is called Dream. It's available for Android or Apple. Uh, don't judge me here. I definitely am starting out with Island Boy uh, just because those guys were the first ones that came to my head and I also wanted to see if they had pop culture references in their database. Judging on the finale, I'm gonna say no, but not bad. It is islandy. And just because we did that, I went the other way. Let's do Island Yell. Thinking, thinking. Here is the result for that one. I mean, so they have island theme, right? No pop references are coming up. It's purely like texture, color, some shapes, I guess. So, all right. Another thing is that the way you can paint, like textures and shapes that come out, you can choose themes. So we're choosing the Ghibli theme here for this one. And maybe Island Boys were too niche, too new. Let's try Bob Marley. Maybe this one might come up with some more accurate results. And this is what the robots came up with. Okay, you know what? Not specific to the man, the myth, the legend himself, but this is a really nice piece. I feel like I could see this hanging up somewhere. All right, so let's try and take some references. I decided next I'm gonna take this picture of me and use it as a reference, as a base, so maybe we can get some more concrete shapes. And we'll put Dreadlock Rasta, not Breadlock Rasta. That could be a fatal mistake here. And I mean, this has got to be something, right? Uh, oh. I hate all of this. Like, oh my God, what is that? Okay, so that was awful. Uh, let's do something a little bit more generic. Let's get off the, off the realism, shall we? Dreadlock flowers, let's go. And I picked surrealism for the style to maybe hopefully get something better out of it. Okay, this is looking like something very Salvador Dali, very dark and uncomfortable, but like nice at the same time. Okay, this one's a win. Two out of whatever. It's gonna click generate again. Maybe we can get another one out of this. And here we go. Still a bit uncomfortable, but very nice. Looks like a real painting. Should we call this a three? Let's call this a three. All right, so they have a couple more themes here. Surreal works. I'm gonna pick uh, robots from Love, Sex, and Robots. They have those as a theme, probably as a sponsorship or something, or a collaboration, I should say. And we'll just go dreadlocks. Just clean, simple. They can't mess this up, right? Hmm, very robotic, that's for sure. 
She's giving Predator. Let's generate this again. See what happens. She thinking, she thinking. Okay, again with the Predator vibes, but I like how this one kind of has a story. It kind of looks like a pre-battle stance. Okay, so this is what the AI thinks that locks are. They think that we're just predator. <laughs> I'm reading this one more time. Let's see. I mean, it's cool. I think we're at a four. I think we're at a four. I'm just gonna make one of those one point, not all of them. What do you guys think? We're switching over to the death theme here, and same clean, just dreadlocks. See what happens. Ooh. I like this. I like this. It's weird, but I like it. What do you guys think? Let's, let's hit generate again. Hmm. This one's cool. I like it. Very witchy. Very, very underworld. But I would have definitely added more colors. I feel like their color, at least for this theme, is super basic. So I'll give it like a 0.5. Half points for this. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. Well, that was an interesting experiment. I am left with not knowing how I feel about the whole experience. Type down in the comments what you guys feel and how did the AI do, in your opinion. And since we're on the topic of robots, like this video, let the algorithm know about me and push my content. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already, and until next time, bye.